Here we're going to be running the closing Colchester, showing a few different speeds. The gearbox inside was repaired, transmission pins were made that were sheared off, the selector was uh, improperly positioned, the key was off the shaft, the gear had to be put back onto the shaft and a new keyway and key had to be made. Before the speeds had to be changed inside by moving it around, the selectors. Now the speed selector works. So now they're going to show you some, uh, some feeding now, show you the feed bar. Feed bar. And the threading bar, we're not moving. Now, the carriage is moving. Now the tool post is moving. A custom piece had to be made for the carriage. as well as a new key and keyway. The machine is feeding and threading as it wasn't before. The tailstock was not locking. Now the tailstock It's locked right now with the bolt. We're going to get a wrench right now to unlock it. Got the bolt and nut and it has to be adjusted by the bottom. moves back and forth and there it's locked with the quick lock perfect great the machine still needs to be checked out and the oiling system they need to make sure as they made a oil system on the bottom we repaired the pan. The pan had 50 to 60 small holes. Oil was dripping everywhere. The holes have been repaired, replaced, and filled. But that is something that came. The new cover was missing half of it. We filled it all in with fiberglass and aluminum. And now the gearbox is covered up. So the gears are inside. Machine is running, speeds can be changed, feeds and threads are now working.